on Monday, an Israeli airstrike hit a building next to Iran's embassy in Syria's capital Damascus. The attack by two F-35 fighter jets killed seven of Iran's military advisors, including senior commander Mohammad Reza Zahedi and Brigadier General Mohammad Hadi Haj Rahimi. Israel has carried out strikes in Syria against Iran and its allies for years, including throughout its six-month military campaign against Hamas in Gaza. However, Monday's attack stood out due to its location in a diplomatic compound traditionally exempted from hostilities and because of the senility of the apparent target. When asked about the strike, an Israeli military spokesperson said, We do not comment on reports in the foreign media. A media report, however, cited four unnamed Israeli officials as acknowledging that Israel had carried out the attack. The strike targeted a secret meeting between Iranian intelligence officials and Palestinian militants to discuss the war in Gaza, according to Iranian officials. Among them were leaders of Palestinian Islamic Jihad, a group armed and funded by Iran. The Iranian US mission urged the UN Security Council to condemn the attack and said Tehran reserved the right to take a decisive response. Hezbollah, the Lebanese militant group backed by Iran, also vowed to retaliate. This crime will not pass without the enemy receiving punishment and revenge, the group said in a statement. Stay tuned to Business Standard to stay updated on the ever-evolving world of geopolitics and more.